I still have not figured out a single special move uh, aside from that weird flip kick. It's 11 o'clock. Do you know where your special moves are? I told you last night, no! Alrighty, we are going to be starting strong, way too strong, uh, with this fighting game I've never heard of before. Do you, do you think you went a little hard on that Logo Light Shock software? Anyway, this is Fighting Spirit for the Amiga, and I'm just going to shut up during this little intro sequence because um, it's something special. Do you All right, so this is Fighting Spirit Supreme Warriors Tournament. <laughs> Look at how much of a ripoff that is of the Fatal Fury Special logo. Put the Fatal Fury Special logo on screen now, please. Jesus. And it has the dragon and the tiger iconography from Art of Fighting as well. It's, um, this is an unabashed, uh, ripoff, uh, homage to SNK games of the early 90s. But this game was like in 95. <laughs> <laughs> Press fire because the Amiga, I guess. Just the, the only. Well, all we got is fire. That's the only button we have. Uh, see, so check out this fucking shit. Have you ever seen anything like this? And then it even uses Fatal Fury font. Year 1990X. Like every year, the myste mysterious Hikawa organization, controlled by Genji Yama Yamamoto, has set up a big illegal tournament, which will turn around the world and will be the challenge between the greatest fighters, the Supreme Warriors Tournament. The reason is to find new warriors for criminal purposes to be enrolled in the Hikawa, but Genji doesn't know that this time he has has to face he has to face the fighting spirit no one wants to face that there's team match and tournament that's actually really cool all right first we got um tong lee then kento then burke yuri eric lawrence shuzar sheila yeah that's a tiger uh yadon and ray Zhang. i'll take eric because he's so american is his his combat style is personal. You can't ask him what it is. And his fighting spirit is the eagle. Now that, therein lies the one thing about this game that's unique. Eric still loves Sheila after he known that his girl is investing best gating on genshi and that he will join the tournament i must find her before genshi meets her even if i will have to fight against her i can't run the risk of losing her forever sheila don't make stupid things don't make it stupid genshi is too strong for you so i don't care if i have to beat the shit out of her i will not i will not allow her to fight genshi all right so we're against lawrence let's see how this goes like i can't believe something that looks like this and is such an overt SNK thing that I didn't know about it before this. Wave Buster! You can dash. You have these handy dashes, which is kind of cool. And you have super so- Oh my god! He just kicked the shit out of me. There's blood on the ground too, which is neat. Neat. Uh, uh, and that's it. I'm looking at this, right? There's effort put in here. Look at that background. That's an, an amazing background. That's a little outdated, obviously, but it's 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 still well made. And there we go. That's our first move. So the only gimmick I can really see with this game is uh, everyone has a beast special move. So mine is the eagle, so I'll turn into this flaming eagle thing. And everyone has like an animal associated with them. So it's a little bit like Bloody Roar, but not at all. I do love these loading screens though. Very Neo Geo CD of you. So next we have Kento. I think these two are like the Ryu and Ken. I just Kento loves the, the color blue. I'm all about that. Gotta dye my hair to, to, to fit my karate gi. Uh. Was that power dunk? It really sounded like it. So when you're moving these characters around, like I, I do have to say, it doesn't feel terrible. I just wish the special moves came out a little bit faster and a bit smoother. The actual movement of the characters is not 
you know, this will not be on the worst fighting game at all. But uh, it is is still a little sluggish in some respects. It's just that the pixel art is pretty damn strong. It's kind of what's saving this thing. Player one one. <sighs> this is so Fatal Fury. It hurts. I like I like Cheng Sunzan in the front showing off his asshole. Haro, Haro, and it's really generic shit that's happening with the projectiles and stuff. Like it looks, everyone's stuff kind of looks the same, and the sprites are a little small for being a a rip off homage to SNK. Oh my god, dragon! Oh wow, I actually cleared that. I'm shocked. Mmm. And as far as I know, that's it for this game in terms of mechanics. Everyone has a sp is just shitting bricks. All right, Tong Li. It's just like there's a bit of Street Fighter here, a bit of a lot of Fatal Fury there, a little bit of art of fighting everywhere, all over the place. Came everywhere. Art of fighting dead. There's just a lot. Like I'm surprised. Look, look at these tigers. Tiger, tiger, tigers. Uh, we're gonna be seeing a tiger later for sure. I do have a pocket Rajang if things go south. If things don't work out with Eric here, I might switch over to him depending on on a couple of different factors. Oh, the Amiga is something that has a couple of fighting games that I've really been meaning to get to. Someone was very gracious and gave me like a whole pack, like a zip folder of all this Amiga stuff that with a lot of janky fighting games and the Amiga was in there. It's where it's where a few, not all, but a few. Uh, wow, just Joe's Tiger Kick straight up. And that was just Rep Puken. It's called Tiger Kick, even though it's clearly a tiger knee. But, you know, that's neither here nor there. Anyway, yeah, some episodes of, of the worst fighting game had uh, had emulated versions of those old games being used on there. So it really did expose me to because I did not. I had an IBM PC growing up. That's it. You know, I had Time Slaughter, uh, Bone Breakers. Well, Bone Breakers was like, uh, I think that was a beat em up, but I did have Time Slaughter and Sango Fighter. And, you know, the, the IBM version of uh, Street Fighter 2, Mortal Kombat 1, and Virtual Fighter PC. That was my fighting game shit. And I, I'd play One Must Fall. Oh, Sheila. So even though she's integral to Eric's story, he just... No, there's nothing that happens here. I thought there'd at least probably be some pre-match dialogue, but it doesn't seem like there is. Maybe it'll happen once the round starts. And look at this sound beach ripoff. Oh my god, it's just it's just spinning bird kick. But yeah, this is this is the most fatal fury. This is more fatal fury than fatal fury is fatal fury this stage. Her thing is that she's into dolphins and and sea life because she just threw uh, Patrick Starfish at me. So that's good. Um, she's really into that shit. That was a weird move. We'll see if she does her, the d dumbass dolphin move. I saw that in the opening demo. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe my eyes. There you go! Oh my god, see that shit! It was almost exactly like Armagon's uh, DP in Tournament Fighters. And just, you'd think I would have seen this in like animated GIFs. you think Dino would have made a GIF about it or something. Uh, showing off glitches. It just, it's just, and any you, you do a deep dive through various articles, like the most obscure fighting games. And I, if I've seen Fighting Spirit before, I hadn't, I forgot about it. I, maybe it just slipped the old memory banks. Lots of things do nowadays, so wouldn't be too shocked. But uh, God, look at that! Look at that shark eating that hot dog. I th that's what that I want. My I want to grow up to be that. I d <laughs> I don't know which part of it. I want. I just I just want some of that. That whole situation. But I'm not a girl. I'm a shark. All right, that wasn't too bad. So yeah, I, I guess I beat her and nothing nothing's going on with that. What? Bodus Why? Crush here, crush it! Slay here! Oh my god. Why are you serious? Oh, oh, there's so much pressure. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. But why? But why? Someone's car might be illegally parked, but this is clearly in a hangar where it should be. Hmm. I didn't even really destroy it. I broke some windows. Oh, what's? <gasps> oh no, my God! Does that does that sound familiar? Did that look feel familiar to anybody? I love the combined "Oh God" and "My Car." Like, oh God, oh my! I'd love it if he just came out and went just like fucking shit, huh? Wait, what? What happened? I was fighting an old guy. Round one. Oh my God, that just sounds like. 
Sagat's name. Is is this a, like an, a, a secret fighter? No, no, it sounds like Zangief's theme. Sorry, I was mixing that up. I did not see him in the character like list earlier, so this has to be like a secret fighter that I'm getting challenged. Like, Akuma. Wait, what? We'll see again somewhere. <laughs> That's the best! That's the GOAT! That is the GOAT! Uh, pre-post-match uh, taunt. Holy shit. I'll see you again somewhen. Ring spire. Ring spire. Wow, that is shit range. I just hit him in the dick with this until he quits. You can't, you can't defeat someone that'll do that. You simply can. Like, this, this is made in Italy, and they, they really, really like SNK and Enkins and Capcom games. They're just, they're just straight up stealing stuff. They're just straight up stealing stuff a lot. Attenzione! Pickpocket! There's just so much that is pickpocketed from all over. But sometimes you have to admire it. You have to. Wait, did he just shoot a monkey out of his... Okay, I must have been imagining that. That didn't happen. We have to move on from whatever that that was. It wasn't what we thought. It was something. Uh, it was like a trick of the mind, you know. <laughs> All right, cool. Yeah, some some characters. I guess we've beaten them a bit too quickly. We can't see what their stupid ass move is. Uh, their beast move. All right, we're halfway through. Yuri, Yuri Sakazaki, perhaps. Ooh, okay. He has a weapon. So combining uh, Sokaku from Fatal Fury 3 and Billy Billy Kane together in one character. Very bold. Yeah, he, he might have predated Fatal Fury 3, to be fair, this guy. Depending on when. I think, because I think both Fatal Fury 3 and this came out the same year. So that's kind of debatable. That was easy enough, though. And a perfect thousand points. Put that on the scoreboard if anyone's keeping track. Maybe there is a super system if we're low on health, perhaps. But I, I don't... I got, a, I got a feeling that there isn't. I mean, that was in Fatal Fury 2 and, and Art of Fighting as well. So it could be there, but... Hmm, we could use a few different winning poses. Well, what sucks is that I don't get, like, pre-match, uh, post-match dialogue. I just had it against, uh... Uh, uh, uh Makuma. You know, I, did, I didn't get more than that with him. That's kind of sucks. Maybe it's in versus mode, but I need to see more of that shit. I guess this is the guy that we trashed his, his chopper. So he's going to be pissed. Yeah, yeah. He's a chopper enthusiast. He used to work for a helicopter support company. What? What was that? Pain. <laughs> this is the most generic dude. Am I fighting against Kazuhira Miller? What? He's got scorpion shit! Shouldn't be too wor worried, but uh, he did, was getting me down in my health there a bit. I guess he is fighting with piss and or vinegar, because I did destroy his chopper. I think this can only be like one, two other characters. What is that move? So many just swirling punches. And those like energy effects around it really remind me of uh, the ones for the punches for Axel Hawk in Fatal Fury 2 in special. Wave rubber! Yeah, thank God. Yeah, I played I played that guy like a goddamn fiddle. They played us like a damn fiddle! That's your requisite Metal Gear Solid 5 reference there. Myself, of course. The greatest battle is within. Eric, Eric, Eric. Don't fire Eric! Oh my God, look at this. This is Terry's stage. It's just from a different angle for fuck's sake. Oh good, we're next to Sun Beach, which is somehow next to the uh, Mount Rushmore. Fuck this stage, it makes no sense. All right, just to took him the fuck out. What is with those balloons? Are those other characters in the game? I don't even know. I don't know, it's, they're very realistic balloons. That's weird. And I always do appreciate a lot of uh, characters watching, uh, a lot of background characters watching the fight. Uh, I always think that's cool. Wave Buster. Yeah! Yeah! Got Rajang. Rajang on deck. Rajang. Rajang, I guess. This is amazing. More animals in fighting games, please. Roger or Alex better be announced for Tekken 8. That's all I can say. And he's not just a tiger. He's like some sort of fucked up tiger, uh, gym bro. He's got little stubbo legs, man. What an unfortunate creature, act- Whoa! Look at him! Look at him! It's like Danny DeVito in a tiger suit. 
All right, let's go this time. And we have to fight Yakon or whatever. Weird lizard man after this. I do like, but, but you know what this makes me think of? This makes me think the entire game should have been animals like this. Like there's already two in the game. Why not? Why not more? Why not an entire game like this in 95? You know, I know there's there's probably something like this, uh, that 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 animal fighting game from the makers of Fight of Gods. I always forget what it's called. Uh, animal Fight, whatever it's called. You know, there's, I'm sure there's some e e Steam indie games that do this. But no, I need things made back in the 90s. I need that to be revealed to me <laughs> that they had weird, fucked up animal animal people in there. All right, so now it's it's y Yadon, Yakon, what's his name? Riptor. Gotcha, Riptor. Yadon. All right, what's this gonna look like? I don't think I've seen this guy before other than his portrait. Okay. Yeah, they're all like these weird, weird stunted growth animal. What? The snake reptile shot a snake and reptile out of its mouth. That's some Rick art, like, like god of serpent boss shit there so so if they have a beast form do they just turn into humans for theirs like i guess i guess rajang turned into like a weird g g blue genie version of himself it was i, I didn't really know what, what that was trying to express there like little burp little little cute fire burps it's so adorbs wait bust fuck i took the worst of that oh my god okay okay how, how about more of that how about more of this yeah. So uh, these are like the the boss's Genchi that we haven't seen yet. I think it's like his subordinates, his jobber. It's his Toka and Razar, you know? Babies! Yeah. Babies! So next we're gonna have to... Oh, fucking hell, man. All right, so after that little break, I have went through the ladder again, but we made a change. The time has come to dare the strongest. That's Genji, huh? Come here, your fate is already marked. I was I was expecting more errors there in the translation. We are Rajang though. We are doing it. Okay, we we couldn't we couldn't do this uh, at least seeing Genji. And he's just like a generic ninja, which I'm kind of disappointed with. Like that's no. And he's tiny. He's little. He's a little short king. Probably okay. I, good for you. What was that? A dragon? Does he is he f using the power of the dragon? So what's the lore here then? If he's the oh my god, he's just bringing out Buddhist deities to fight for him. Come on, come on. No, no. It's very very Jago esque a little bit, huh? A little bit, I feel. Jago or E.G. Kisaragi from KOF. Uh, the stage is very geese hour, I'll give it that much. Uh, but we can do this, we can do this. We can Rajang out. Because I, I decided against the I, against Eric because I didn't really want to fight it again. I get with the same guy and just, it would be way more boring for me. But we do want to see the final bit. Imagine what Raj, fuck. Imagine what Rajang's ending will be. That's why I did this. Well, let's just take another shot at it. Where did you think to go, eh? Oh, poor kitty. I have one more shot at this. I barely pulled off any of the, the special moves last time. I was too focused, too too talking. I have Mr. G Star 321 syndrome. All right, we're gonna do it now. I've almost I almost got him on the ropes. Ah! Oh, the fucking psycho crusher, dragon based psycho crusher. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rawr. Look at look, even his like weird like uh spiritual form is cute. Weird stubble legs. A weird creature. Does he even have a tail? I haven't even noticed it. Oh my god. No, he doesn't have a tail. That's weird. No wonder his balance is all off center and fucked up. They need that shit. Uh, come on, come on. Uh, yeah! No, thank god. I better not have to beat him in like three rounds or some shit. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna do or is there a second form? Yeah, look at him. His sexual aura cannot be denied. Uh, Genshi's murder was only the top of the metamorphosis that Rajang was undergoing. His own instinct with the fury and the revenge typical of human being brought him to looking desperately for freedom. Now, at last, he could live in peace. Wait, what? The end. Finn. 
<laughs> okay? So the bloodlust of revenge that humans enjoy has given this creature peace, I guess. That's nice. I'm happy for him. This is like my new jank king now. This is this is my absolute top favorite. Like, this is the worst game. Just because the concept is like the gameplay is fine. It's like kind of basic, but everything else around it is so amazing. Like they tried here, you know? It is is again. Uh, when you make a bad thing, you have to have tried. If you purposely make a bad thing, it, it, it works very rarely. It can work, but it's it's way harder. Amazing. Fighting spirit, mwah, number one. So that is it for our first fighting game today. And I and I and I it's gonna be hard to top this, but I think uh, carry out the work at Capcom is done over by over. Oh, they're saying Jacinto. Uh, did so much work that he only did it, but Capcom needed 10 guys to do it. All right, so we have five more games to go, so let's get it rolling. All right, so next up we have a PC MS-DOS fighting game that you'd think would have been my jam, that I would have talked about once or twice. This isn't uh, Savage Warriors or, or Time Slaughter. This is Time Warriors. I honestly don't know much about it. I saw one gameplay video a few days ago, and there's no sound. Shodan, Shodan, uh, uh, Moloch, uh, uh, Apocalypse. I'll take him. I am as far beyond mutants as they are beyond you. Round one. Oh, never mind. Amazing. Sizzik. <laughs> so yeah, uh, kind editor, please put some uh, music, maybe maybe uh, Mace the Dark Age music over this to, to spice it up. It needs it already. Oof, that crackle. So yeah, maybe maybe I needed the CD version of this game. Maybe I actually need the CD to to get CD quality sound. This game is from 1997, by the way. Uh, Virtual Fighter. That that's 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 after Virtual Fighter 3. Just saying that for context. Dude, do something. Oh, that was lame. I'm all I. You know, I, I had some um, hope that there would be like a fatality sequence there, like a finish him prompt. There was not. This seems like a game that would have violence. Okay, I have a little hop. I have a little uh, dodge. That's something. Hey, Zagungu. Amazing. Olaf. I thought his name was Oof for a second. Some of this isn't Oof. I, I can imagine though that there might be someone out there circa 1997 on their on their family PC and they found a shareware disc or or download or whatever of this and be like this is the greatest massive nostalgia blast I get you I get you but but I'm starting to see why maybe I haven't heard about this I put this game Time Warriors into YouTube I maybe came out with three videos. The vast, vast majority is just the Warriors game by Rockstar. Like, I wish I, I, I was playing Mace the Dark Age. That, that was a perfect, though. Got a P on the board. Like, like I have to assume there's more special moves in this, but I've, I've tried everything here. I think that's a special move. That drop kick. That was back forward. Uh, one of the attacks. What, the, what, what this strikes me is that this was, like, the development group, the studio, the probably three or four people that worked on this was kind of like put together their first 3d game and this is this is what they got because aside from the gimmick of it being warriors throughout time what are we actually doing here now there is a bar that we're building up slowly i notice and maybe we get a move based off that wow you get a lot of meter when you get hit but these guys aren't hit wow wow that's the sound. That's like a sound of getting a clue in like a Phoenix Wright game. That's not the the, the sound of uh, your your meter filling up. But you want to attack me, please? Oh, he's, he's he's hesitating. He's scared. Can you even ring out in this? I feel like you possibly could, but we'll we'll see if that's that's a thing later. Na -na. Oh, what was that? That was like Sophia's Our Revolution in Toshin then. Wow. Dong! Yeah. Okay. The, the, I, you know, looking, that is a, f a photo that was taken 
of of the sunset. That's that's absolutely a photo. It's not pixel art, but they're using it nicely, right? You just you're just taking that, huh? Okay, now you're blocking. Good. See, I'm teaching the CPU to play. Do a special. Do your super. And then the meter counts down. So that's kind of fucky. Do something. Hit me. Kill me. Anything. Do something about it. All right, dude. Well, now your super ran out. I'm guessing it's super. I don't, I don't know for sure. Oh, my God. Let's see what a timeout looks like, I guess. He hates it. Okay, well, you should have hit me. I feel bad. I'm being up on this old guy. I just came up to his temple and just started throwing hands, throwing, throwing swords. And it's funny. We have another time-based fighting game I, we're playing later. Maybe directly after this. On, on how we decide to separate it. Let's get this over with. What is even the boss of this going to be? Like Genghis Khan or some shit? Alexander the Great? Well, after I'm done with him, he's gonna be Alexander the the mid. Okay, Shodan! Reminds me of uh, Mongo, again, from Battle Arena Toshinden. This might have been like a Battle Arena Toshinden ripoff. Oh, look at that. Look at that jiggling swamp water. I like that. Mmm, that's got some Angela White bounce to it. <laughs> Dude, hit me. Let's, let's get into the drink. Come on. Hello? All right. Do, do, do something more. Come on, push it to the limit, please, anything. All right, let me get back on the other side. Because I can't, I'm pressing back on here. I'm pressing like uh, uh, backdash and, and my character is not, is not going. So I can't like self-suicide into the swamp water. Hit me, please. Yeah. Wow, that was so fast. There was no splash effect at all. Maybe I needed like a 3D FX voodoo card. Maybe that would have made this awesome. It certainly, it's it's possible, but I didn't even see who published this. It, it just seemed to be like whoever developed this was all, also self-published it, which you could do on the PC. That was possible, but that may be why I've almost never heard of this game. Come on. All right, I love, gotta love that scratch. Can't do nothing about that, folks. Sorry. Oh my god, I didn't even realize I got. Oh, I because I fell in. I fell into the water. So another scintillating round of combat here. Like I'll never get my meter up uh, unless someone hits me. You need to start me off. You need to start me up, and then I'll I'll get it up. You just you, you need to give me something, something workable, and then and then we can get the match really going. All right, I have it. I have it. Finally, have it. Anything. I'm pressing down, down, half circles. Fuck. Amazing. Moloch, like that. Looks like a beefcake. Oh, I should've taken Moloch. He looks like a Conan. Or like a Conan He-Man. He-Man Conan. I like the stage though. It's another clear photo that was taken of a forest somewhere. Oh, okay, we have a throw. Throw confirmed. That was that was back an attack, not forward an attack, which is just weird. Just trying to feel him out. What do you want? What do you want to do? I'll sell for you. What do you want? Oh wait, what? Down, down, punch. Okay, so we have one more special, I think. It's really, I guess, it's good for getting out of the corner. But that's about it. I can't teleport in front of him. Time up. Yeah, apocalypse of default victories. So yeah, the one the one clear looking special move that I was able to find is a super defensive one that puts me away from the enemy. So it's not an offensive one. The the meter thing has to be I'm I'm missing there. And and before you ask folks, I looked this up. I lo I looked up an FAQ for this game. Absolutely zero. Could not find a move list anywhere. If you can find one, I I salute you. Those who are about to die salute you. If you find a move list, I'd be very impressed. And it happens sometimes. You can find a fighting game uh, that has no move list. I've done it before. I did it today. All right. Finally, we will know who is better, Apocalypse or Apocalypse. At least the stages are thematically themed towards the fighter. Oh, that was a hard knockdown if I've ever seen one. Egzungu. You've never seen high pass uh, Evo matches. Wait, what, what happened? What happened there? The game just quit. It was just like, no, we're good. Okay, well, yeah, you got me there. That's that's fair. Ah, oh, okay. I am getting hit. You can hit me. There you go. 
Oh, you only kill me. Never mind. So this this will go on further. This is, folks, uh, in the YouTube business, this is called uh, trying to squeeze blood from a stone. And hopefully that blood will form into an entertaining section of a video. What? What happened? <laughs> what was that? What was that interaction in the video game that just occurred? Just get away. This is the match that never ends. Yes, it goes on and on, my friends. Some people started playing and not knowing what it was. This is the time warriors will never end. Oh, he was doing something. I hit him out of it. Eagle. Gosh him, yeah. Okay, now we're talking. Ooh, loom me up, daddy. What are you? You're cool. I feel like I'm fucking fighting Kane in 1997. <laughs> or playing the Virtual Boy. Why is it all the red? It's, it's a choice. I know this game has endings. Again, my information is extremely limited. I, I did not... I I searched for uh, Time Warrior endings. Couldn't, nothing. What the fuck? Okay, he almost killed me there. Yeah. And just, we're in front and... Yeah, we're we're fighting this devil and routing the uh, uh, the outback of Australia. Is that Ayers Rock back there? Perhaps not. Not that one though. The, the, so one of these, one of those mountains. Oh shit! Did, I don't remember Gosham being in history. Let me know when Gosham took over like a country or a continent in the past. I don't know anything about Gosham. What do you do? What did he conquer? Let me know in the comments what Gosham's deal is. I have to beat this fucker. And also I just noticed the time is now- Oh shit. The time has gone back uh, up to infinite. <laughs> yeah, hit him with the old amazing Gungu. Huh? What? Oh! Get up! <laughs> so lame. All right, well, what's- is that the boss? Fuck off! With these messages. Magic move? Why did you tell me that at the start? All right, let's try magic move. Let's just go, just do some magic. Let's see what that looked like. That must be our super, right? Sure, let's fight. Let's do it. Dude, dude, hit me. I need magic. I can get a little bit by being offensive. Anything. Oh, not that. Ah. Uh. Ah. <laughs> Damn it! Ugh. Let's try again. All right, Apocalypse versus Isbal. I let me just see if I can do this special super. We just call it a day on fucking Time Warriors, cause I I'm kind of at the edge of my rope here. Not gonna lie, he is. Finally, this guy's got got some Kavorka. It does not work. That was a lie. That screen. It does nothing. No. I need content for the video! Stop! Oh! Yeah, there's no content <laughs> in this section. So yeah, Time Warriors, um, that was rough. I'm not gonna lie, there's really not that much to say about it. And uh, we have to move on to our other games, because I absolutely have no time for these warriors. Oh, um, yeah, yeah, oh. Yes? I need Liam. Liam? Okay. I did it. Hey, so uh, this is a Capcom fighting game that they published and developed on Renderware. A late era PS2 fighter. Now, I always kind of confuse this with the Fate. I know that Capcom published a Fate uh, fighting game based on the anime, but this is based on uh, Ken Kenichi, the world's strongest disciple, or the greatest disciple. An anime that I've seen the cover of, the box art of, of the home release. Hey, I like that cute bear. Ooh, I love that bear. Ooh. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I've I seen his cover before, and I may have seen some clips, but I've never actually watched this show. But i um, kind of shocked to see that Capcom made... A fighter based on this just this was like two weeks ago i learned about this i don't see everyone talks about oh uh yeah sengoku basara x capcom made remember that one that's crazy and that was it but there's this and the fate game no one really talks about that much i think i played the fate game like once ever this never and late era ps2 this is like 2007 or some shit which is which is there we were in there surprised it didn't have a ps3 version yeah, title screen.
Kenichi! Oh man. Uh, uh, this CPU? CPU fights? Uh, cool. Oh, oh, wow. That is a lot of locked characters. Cool. I'll, uh, Kenichi's kind of boring. I'll take this check. Costume 2. Oh, uh, Whirlwind? I don't know. Yeah, that looks like that looks like a guy that would be in the show. Big roll energy coming off her. All right, looks pretty good. I like the UI with the flames. Let's see. All right, attack string there. I I don't have shoes, which is a little weird. Oh my god, there's a counter button. That's A. That's just like, ow, knee in my bum. That's rough. Okay, throw is with triangle, huh? So each button, one is like melee strikes. One is like this kicking move and one is counter. So trying to look at those meters. What the fuck am I going to do with those? All right, there's there's Ooh, cool. It's like so few games except for Dead or Alive have like a dedicated parry defense button. Okay, okay. That's some stuff. What the? Okay, that was a sh left shoulder button. Was a taunt? Uh oh. Oh, he's installing some shit. What is that? Oh! Keep blocking. No idea how he did that. I've been doing like double quarter circles because I have meter or I did. Okay, yeah, don't don't taunt at all. Uh, maybe unless I'm really far away, I have no idea what taunting would actually do. Yeah, 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 yes, please die. Gee, it, it, it sucks because a game like this, like an anime game, you want to be able to do flashy supers. I'll, I'll have to figure them out. Ooh, spooky Castlevania stage. She's pointing at her like, hey, you only have one pant leg. That character's cool. I wish I could take her too. Alright, that, that was a big ass whiff throw. I like the running moves though. It's very snappy. Like if I was to describe how this plays a little bit, how it feels, it I'd say it feels a little bit like uh, Bloody Roar, honest honestly. The the way you dash and run in with attacks, it yeah, it makes me feel and some of these special moves just remind me of some stuff in Bloody Roar. She's not falling for it. Ah, you fell for that though, bitch. Oh! Wait a minute! Oh! Damn! Oh wait, just cut it off. So that was like two shoulder buttons together. So that's a that's an easy operation super. I was overthinking it as as I tend to do. Because when you have such a large chess club quality brain like myself, you tend to but, but anime games typically have easy inputs for like supers and stuff. I don't even know if that's super finished. I feel like it still had an animation left to go, like a like a big finish. There you go. Yeah, I am Daijobu. I'm fine. Thank you for asking, lady. Uh, I don't know these characters' ages. <laughs> Always, always concerned. Okay, this just looks like a store owner that walked in the alley and I'm just fighting him now. What was that cat? I heard a cat noise. Oh my God, there's a cat in the window. <laughs> That's what I'm concerned about the most right now. The, the, the kitty noises are so distracting. I just gotta beat this dude up so I can look at the cat more. There it is, it's, there's maybe two of them. Incredible Capcom. Capcom, more like Catcom, ha 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 ha. Oh, I deserve that. Oh, I need... There, there they are. They're at Pet Shop. All right, cool. They're animating everything. One's on its tummy. Or like showing his tummy, rather. If they're showing their tummy to you, that means they're very, very relaxed. And they feel safe. So uh, you definitely feel like you can get some combos going in this. Going from the attack string. Let's, let's see the full animation, though. Damn, 31 hits, okay. It wasn't like a big finishing hit at the end there. Probably could've used like an extra stomp, but still a pretty solid super. Don't know if there's more than that because that's, when I have one bar and I've pressed both super buttons together, nothing's happened. So he's on max, he's sitting on max super meter. I don't know what the fuck that's gonna be. Or no, he just used it. I guess some special moves use super as EX. Nice, okay, that's a different throw. All right, all right, we're, we're, we're figuring things out. I wonder if he, Max knows about this 
or hell justin you know capcom made this fucking fighting game for the ps2 that never got released outside of japan like the like most people go to oh sengoku basara x that's oh yeah the sengoku game so we're gonna see what kenichi has I'm already not impressed with them. Looking at him though, he reminds me a lot of the altern uh, alternative costume that uh, Bakuryu has in, um, in uh, Bloody Roar. He's got like that uniform on. It's like not my favorite. I prefer him as a ninja. Uh, it's a very small arena. I'm not sure if there's wall splats. I feel like there is, there is not. Okay, I have this mobility move. Yeah, by the way, I should mention this. You can't jump in this game at all. You press up and down, they just walk. So you have to press up and and, and a button to even do a jump. So it's very ground-based, which keeps things simple, I guess, but nice. I'm impressed with the amount of counters that have already been there. I guess it's dependent on what you're being attacked with. Uh-uh-uh. Yeah, I'm not sure if there's like a level three. L let's see if I can get to level three and activate supers, see what happens there. I can't really attack off that, whoa, whoa. He's doing shit. Okay, maybe that's what you get at level three. At level one, you can use it for something. I, I don't know what quite yet. Level two is a super and level three is like to go in into an install and then you can do something off of that or you do more damage. All right, we have it. Okay. Oh, wait, this might be that, that, um, that option I need to select when I select my character. It was either fire or like wind. Maybe that's what, what governs that. I'm not sure. She's tuckered out. She had a big day. All right, guy with, oh my God. That looks like, is that dude from the show? That's the most background NPC I've ever seen. Like he looks like he's from a simple 2000 game. Okay, can we get knocked off? There needs to be more ring out. That This game needs ring outs. Needs an element with the stages. He's fucking dead. No, he's back, folks. He's good. Surprise, bitch. I bet you thought you'd seen the last of me. So we'll see if we can make this last a little bit longer just to see what this guy can actually do. But he does not look like he's a main cast member. That might, that might, that might be the most underdesigned character I've seen in a long time. Like, that's, that's default character creator 02. Fucking dead. Made orphans of his children. Yeah, they, they have a mother, Matt. Yeah, I know, but I imagine she would die of grief. Okay. This is like that one dude from KOF 14 and 15 that I never remember what his name is. I don't know, the sand guy. I always always forget. <laughs> anyway. So we're, we're in the most dramatic of places in an anime. It's on the school roof where all types of fucked up shit has happened. So, th so this is what I would like. I would like cages. Like, um... Uh, Bloody Roar. I know I've mentioned Bloody Roar a couple of times, but I will always mention Bloody Roar. Uh, like Bloody Roar or, you know, uh, Fighting Vipers. I would love to blast this guy through the <laughs> I would love to clip that. I would love to blast this guy through this cage. Uh, or fence, rather. Perfecto! Nice. That just leads to, like, a bit more tension knowing that uh, you can get a ring out. No, maybe, maybe there's a mode uh, on the main menu or there's an option that sets that, I don't know. I wonder, I don't think this has been translated at all. And there's a lot of UI stuff going on in different fonts and such. All of this is written in English to be fair, except for the uh, character names, but uh, just the main menu. Cause like, this is not, this is pretty good. I, I'm probably, ooh. Oh, wait, what? Oh, that wasn't that great. I feel like there must be level threes. I'm probably missing that. Anyway, this is, this is, yeah, very solid. Um, it does feel basic, but I'd like to think I'm still missing some nuances of the fighting system and whatever that option was, uh, when I pick my character. Because, yeah, I don't, I don't see why you couldn't, uh, translate this and put that out there. Who is this? Oh, showdown at the docks. Yeah, honey. Go you just call me honey. How dare you? I just noticed my character is now wearing shoes. She did not, she was not wearing shoes when we started. Uh, that's weird. Did I gain shoes? Did I level up my feet? Oh, maybe it's because we we're in like a dojo or something. And both of the, but maybe both characters didn't have shoes on. That's a small detail. That's just another guess. I don't know. I'd have to look back at the footage. But I swear she did not have feet. I mean, I swear she did not have shoes when we started. Okay, dude, hit you from behind. Uh, I was hoping for like, I don't know, a different super animation when you hit a uh, character from behind, but I gotta take what I can get. 
So I did see on the main menu, there's like a dedicated story mode where you play as Kenichi and have to do training and stuff. Um, so there does seem to be that uh, for those that are interested. This is just the arcade mode. I'm assuming I pick. I'd like to think and we'll get fight a boss, get a character ending. I'm not sure if we will. Um, I, I'm amazed I was able to navigate that much because there are a lot of options on the menu. Oh, shit. I, I don't think I'm at that level where I know what can connect and what can't, but I'm, I'm certainly a little bit in the dark here. Fuck. So I still wonder, I can't see any immediate difference in this mode. Shit, I didn't mean to press that. I don't see like an immediate damage buff or, or being able to combo into things easier. So it's gotta have a purpose though. Oh shit. Yeah, look at this dude. Yeah, that's the dude. Big Kiyosuke uh, energy from uh, rival schools a little bit, obviously. Different hair color and such, but I wonder if uh, if he wins, he'll push his glasses up his nose a little bit. We shall see. Oh shit, he's not messing around. Oh, wait, what hit me? What did he do? I think he just glared at me. His glower power. <laughs> oh, no. Can I, cause I, I saw one or two characters like combo into their super from that state, but I'm pressing the super buttons again and nothing's, nothing's coming out. Ah. Oh. That's fine. It does seem like there's only like one or two throws. It'd be cool if you can get different throws uh, based on your position. Like how throws work in like Tekken or Soul Calibur, but it doesn't seem to be that elaborate, at least not yet. And like there's only two characters here that I was able to select. So if you had a full roster, it looked like there was what, 12, 15 characters? It's a decent amount. It's just that it sucks when there's like licensed fighting games or licensed anything really, but we're talking fighting games this week. Uh, but licensed fighting games like like this, like the Fate game, like the JoJo uh, fighting game that Capcom put out. They did re-release it a couple of years back, but that they're just lost to time. All right, we're, we're putting it down to the wire here. Cause it's like Capcom will never ever be able to be like, here's anime fighting game collection coming soon. Like no one, no one ever does that. It's very rare. Like in those, those really not common instances, like the Scott Pilgrim game coming back, you have to re-license, re-up that, that whatever it is. TV show, cartoon, uh, movie. And like, I don't think Kenichi the Disciple is like a hot property right now. There's still no Chainsaw Man game, but when there is, that thing's gonna be like, get that when that's out. Cause it's never gonna come back after a certain point, that particular game. What? Just hard cut to, to anime ending? Okay. Uh, so that was Kenichi, really long title. Oh, that dude is in the anime. He's, he's sucking on an ice cream. Uh, yeah, so that's Kenichi, the great disciple, the world's greatest disciple, whatever. Yeah, like I said, that that's really solid. Um, but I'm definitely missing some nuances and mechanics. But what's there, what I was able to figure out, you know, it seemed pretty good. So let me know what you thought in the comments about this one. Should I go back to it? Should I learn some more stuff? Would you like to see the, the uh, Fate game that Capcom put out or anything like that? Do let me know in the comments below. But for now, we have a few more games we need to punch through. So let's get to doing that. All right, we've got some handheld action right now. This is Gear Buster. No, no, it's, it's a uh, Buster fight, yeah. Thanks. Thanks, title screen. <laughs> so this is a Game Gear game, but I believe it also had a Master System version under the title of Masters of Combat, which really, which really lent itself well for the Master System brand, you know? That makes sense. All right, game start. Let's do it. All right, in 20XDX, there was a UFO. That's, that's what I'm reading there. Unidentified Anomalous Phenomena, or UAPs, also known as UFO. God love 20XDX. So yeah, this is this is the boss, I believe. I think he's on the box art buster fight and he, he is some type of... And then Geese Howard shows up in mid blink and he's like, we gotta stop this shit. I can't let the Howard connection be bought out by this. So, so now Ninja, Gonzalez. Uh, Hayate, high volt man, high voltage. And then Wing Berger, which is one of the most awkward names ever. Hayate, he looks like a cool ninja. I think he's the Ryu and or Ken of this game. It's pronounced Nucleus Plant. Uh, that's the first level against this weird uh, donut man. 
He just looks lumpy, I don't know. An unfortunately shaped fellow. So, the thing with this game, having never heard of it before, but looked up the instruction manual a bit, since the Game Gear and Master System were two buttons, uh, you have one attack, and then one button for mobility. So one is jump, which always... Oh my god, he just did an atomic jump? Um, so one is jump, and that, that does all your mobility. What's cool about it is if you hold it and press forward, you do a dash forwards and backwards. And you have some special moves too, like this, but, but the son of a bitch is blocking a lot. So already, this plays... Like, it takes some getting used to, but I, I think this works for a handheld. It's amazing to me handheld uh, only fighting games like especially in the 90s i guess a bit in the early 2000s as well uh, everything before the psp really because then because then you know the the hardware is beefy enough and had enough face buttons where it wasn't that big of an issue shit but buster fight i've n i that does sound like something i'd heard of before but i think this was only released in japan and masters of combat may have been released in in outside of japan so you, i do have this this uh kicking combo and i also have an ultimate move which is like a sword slash i think it does a lot of damage but i haven't hit it yet it's like forward if you tap a kick you just tap by attack rather you get like this little auto combo which seems pretty cool i'm not sure if all the characters have that what is the goddamn move for the sword attack oh jeez. oh with the german damn no that's not what i want but oh was that it i feel like stop throwing power waves <laughs> oh my god just just too busy i hate that shit i'm too busy trying to do a cool move for the video oh wait i lost because i'm a fool i suffer myself all the time but the thing with that uh fire move uh sorry the ultimate move is is that i think you can do it at any time it doesn't have to be like when you're low on health or anything uh, uh, uh. that's it yeah there's a big wind up but damn two of them and he's dead you win and the animation is actually quite nice. Like, I've only played, like, I don't know, a dozen Game Gear games in my life. Uh, you must defeat my ninja sword that Mac could barely do to stand a chance. That's what I'm going for. That's what I'm going with there. So now we're in the SWAT base. My fellow SWAT officers, all of you, thank you for believing in me. Which has way too much funding put into it. And high volt, man. That's a terrible name. Oh my god. Big jobber energy coming off him. Wow, wait, what? Never mind. There's actual rebounding off walls? That's sick. Um, very Guile-esque stage. Just replace, uh, jets with tanks. Going back to the Game Gear and being like, holy shit, there was a, a an exclusive fighting game for the Game Gear? Like, not like a port of like, or any well-known franchise like Fatal Fury or, or Street Fighter. I don't think there was a Street Fighter. I'd, I'd be down to playing more Game Gear games, uh, especially good ones. I'd rather not go to crap ones because I remember in the 90s, I thought it looked worse. But I think I was, then the Game Boy, I, but I think I was looking at screenshots of specific games in like an EGM. There was like an X-Men game that I felt didn't look very good. Or a superhero game, I forget which one it was. I just remember thinking like, yeah, there's color, but like the graphics look worse. But I think it was just because that specific game was like, had bad graphics. And going back to it now, like having played that, uh, that terrible Double Dragon Game Gear, which, oh my god! Yo, there's some attacks in this! There's some moves! Um, going, go, going, looking at this especially, like I'm impressed with the amount of animation in the backgrounds too. When that last round finished up, people were going ham in the background, flashing their tank lights. That's when you know they're hype. God, his uppercut, while it seems good, it gets blocked an awful lot. Come on, fuck. Uh, oh, I think that might have been his ultimate. I don't really need to go for the sword hit, but... Yeah, 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 he's dead as shit. Yeah, look, everyone get mad hype there. Everyone just fist pumping, beat that beat up. All right, so, so uh, now I've defunded your SWAT base. Suck it. Bonus stage. What are we doing here? Oh my God, is it just, are we doing, oh, I thought we were gonna be doing like Shenmue. <laughs> Breaking a forklift. Now, unlike a car, forklift has like lots of uses. Forklifts are special machines. You shouldn't, you shouldn't beat up. But what did that forklift do to you, Ayate? Okay, and uh, so, so we have an industrial complex now with Windberger. He looks kind of cool. He does remind me a bit of like Burnoff. If 
from Double Dragon. But I don't really know what his deal is. Does he have... Oh, he stretches. Never mind. A little bit of not so much Dalsim, but like Brocken in World Heroes. Or, geez, uh, Chrome Dome in uh, Tournament Fighters. Uh, this dude, you know what? I feel like I'm playing right now, this, these two characters on screen, a Ninja Gaiden fighting game. This guy really reminds me of like an enemy you'd find in, in Ninja Gaiden 1 to 3 on the NES. I don't know if this is the type of character where he throws out that alt. I don't even know what it looks like, whether I should be wary of it. I guess if it has a really extended wind up, that would be it. But, oh God, they do. They're, they're starting to block an awful lot. Uh, okay, maybe maybe just projectiles. Okay, no. He smartened up to my projectile spamming ways. It's a legitimate strategy, ask Justin. If you see me, if you see me doing a shitty annoying tactic in a fighting game, just know for sure that Justin told me it was okay. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Oh, oh. Okay. Almost botched that. I wasn't too bad. Um, so I think there's one other character left, and, and maybe it's it's the greatest character that you have to fight yourself. I'm assuming because there's only four playable characters, they might as well make you play, fight yourself. Temple, yeah, Hayate versus Hayate mirrors. Let's go. Uh, 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 uh. I like the sort of like techno theme they have in in the background and stuff, and and mixing that with a temple. It's always cool looking shit. Oh my god, I'm getting my I'm getting my shit bopped here. Uh, uh. Oh wow, that just goes to the projectile, huh? Oh my god! How do I do a throw? I even see- Oh! And that's animated really well. Ah, wow, my single projectile cancels out the double. That's cool. I think. Yeah, yeah, sword slash! Uh, oh! Come on! Let's go! Barely, barely won that though. Little nervous, because I think, I think that ju I just lucked out there. You know, like, it, it, any of my success in fighting games, I swear is 50% luck. 10% skill, 50% concentrated power of will. <laughs> I think 50% is a little high for my concentrated power of will. It's like, I think it's like more like 60% luck, 5% skill. Oh shit. Okay, sometimes I'll do the, the, the motion for the ninja sword attack and then it just doesn't come out. I think I'm doing it too fast. I, I don't think it requires precise movements. Fuck. On the game gear pad, my legitimate game gear that I'm playing this. Oh my God. Oh, oh. I doubt I could have mashed out of that in time. You lose. <sighs> uh, I am a little bit worried. You know why? Because I think this game has uh, a limited amount of continues. Because uh, they would have to. For uh, an handheld game that's this short, they would have to have limited continues to make sure you just can't beat in one run. So I'm a little... Oh my god. Ah! Oh my... So that's, so that's, that's a perfect... Get that P on the board there. Damn. All right, how many do I actually have left? Sh uh, one. I guess this is it. Uh, uh. We are starting off very poorly. If you're just tuning in, <laughs> if you took a small break to get uh, a snack or something, it's going badly here in Gear Buster. I mean, Buster Fight. I don't know why I keep saying gear. Jeez. How does he? How does he block? in the middle of the string. He got hit by the first hit, but then just blocked the rest of it. Now, I'm not saying that the CPU is cheating, but what I'm saying is that the CPU is most likely cheating. Ah, uh, yeah! J just spam the alt. That's, oh no, maybe not when he's right next to me. It's neck and neck here though. We can do it. No, we can't. We cannot do it. That's what I, that's what I get for having faith in myself. No, no, no. Okay. It makes sense that the, the last character are, I guess the second to last character. There, there's a big uptick in difficulty there. That, that makes sense to me. Oh my God, how did I get knocked out that fast? Or dizzy that fast rather. So I'm in burnout state. Oh Jesus, oh, how? He's in my head. <laughs> oh, I think that's it, man. Uh, I, 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 don't, I don't think I can go through that ladder again. We, we have a couple more games to go. Uh. Oh, what does the boss look like? What does the final boss look like? Splice that in right here, right now, please. Biologics came with some of these recoveries. Were they, I guess, human or non-human biologics? Okay, thank you. Um, <laughs> that is Buster Fight. That's still really fun. That's really well made for an 8-bit. I think it was, I think the Game Gear was 8-bit. Let me know in the comments. Um, so yeah, that, that, that was very shocking and surprising to me that that plays as well as it does. Uh, but I think we have one or two more games to go, so let's get it on. Okay, so this is that other time-based fighting game I mentioned that we were playing time 
Warriors. This is not time. There's not time for Time Warriors. Now time for Mighty Warriors. Heroic fighters of the past return from the darkness of eternity to regain with the right to live a, a new place in the world of the living. A long infernal challenge, dense with bloody battles, in which only one will be deserving of the final reward. That guy. This guy. What the hell is that guy? Okay. C yeah. 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 What a bunch of sexy boys. Loving these lads. <laughs> Thank God. So, uh, you know, I, I'd i like to think out of all fighting games, I would know arcade ones the best. Like, I've plumbed the depths, but I guess I haven't. Because, yeah, Mighty Warriors, absolutely not never. Not never, no never in my life have I seen this one. Yeah, I'll, ta I'll take Maximus. Is random gladiator cool? They should be in a time based fighting game. K Kai oh, they get different names. Round one fight. So, off the bat, I my eye is drawn to the mutant meter. Fuck is that? A lot of a lot of parallax scrolling going on here with the stage. If you see, oh my god, it's tag. How do you tag? That's the mutant meter. It must mean mutate. Probably, it should probably say morph. What the hell? I pressed every, what the hell is that face in the middle of the life bars? Okay. It's the announcer. But the face looks like, where did you learn to fly? All right, and I noticed we, we got our, our shit knocked off. I can throw a green fireball, that's something. I gotta say, the backgrounds are pretty impressive, technically. And who the hell is this guy? Like, this is like a Scotsman, isn't it? And he's got like a pitchfork and and green pants or something. I don't what the shit is that? With my big rubber energy fists! The hell is that banging noise? What's happening? I do like how you get uh points for being armed or not. Armed? No. Uh okay then. No I can protect you from my hits. Alright, let's try somebody else though. Uh yeah, this person? Ekator? E e Does that say Gandalf? A wizard is never late, nor is he early. He arrives precisely when he means to. He's Gandalf! Yeah, Why does that sound so familiar? Oh my god. It's, it's, um, uh, it's, it's the Punisher from the, uh, sorry, from the Capcom arcade game. Throw that up, please, once I start making the noise again. Yeah, it really sounds like it. I'm sorry. Sorry I'm getting distracted by that shit, but like, what year? Because this looks like it was made like in like 91. The Punisher arcade game came out in 93. So I don't know what the what the deal is then. Maybe Capcom stole it from them? We don't know. We're gonna have to check the dates on that. Anyway. E Echination, try to flap your wings now. Oh! Fucking got him! All right, so. Let's stick with him. Who are we fighting? McNatch. McMatach. McMatach. I don't know. Yeah, we're we're he's he's a Scotsman, I guess. Or 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 he's from the UK. That part of the world, I don't know. I don't know if these guys are based on historical figures. None of these names uh, strike me as particularly relevant. You know, you can get Leonardo da Vinci fighting Genghis Khan. That'd be sick. Uh oh! Backbreaker! Oh my god, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose. Yeah! See? I was saying, gonna lose, gonna lose, gonna lose to throw that guy off. And he felt pity towards me and how pathetic I was. And then I threw him. Ba bam! So a lot of you probably uh, asking yourselves, Matthew, and I'd be like, don't don't call me that. Like, Matthew, alright, okay, fine. Uh, how does this play? It's not good. It, I, it, it's hard to describe, actually. It's not terrible by any stretch of the imagination. But a lot of these specials and normals just feel really awkward. I guess it's because the the sprites are awkward themselves. Like, everyone is a weirdo. That's just Sagat's uh, winning pose. That was weird. Uh, we're going into the third round, I guess. Sorry. And uh, I think that moon might be a little too big in the background there. That's either a moon or a giant yellow egg. Egg. 
But that's concerning that it's that close to the Earth. We might, you might want to get out of the way. 72 hours remain. Less than that. 72 minutes remain. Maybe. Before that shit crashes into us. God damn it. Uh, oh, no. Come on. Now you look like your camel. <laughs> what? I have a hump on my back, I guess. Dad, I wanna be a camel. It's filled with life-saving liquid. All right, let's try uh, es Estocles. Uh, we, we made great success with uh, Pancreas or whatever. The guy that we used in Time Warriors. Oh my God, look at this dude now. I don't even want to know what part of the world they're, they're going to say he's from. Oh, I just burp gas at him. The, the most noble of all ancient warriors. This is how they fight. This is how you win battles. Yeah, I, I, you know, I can't, uh, I can't front with results, and I got the results there. Okay, let's do it. Just slash them up. There's no reason to do anything more fancy than that. Yeah, 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 I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Still can't figure out the button to tag, by the way. I've literally pressed everything I can think of. If you are a mighty warrior, uh, super fan, if you are a try-hard mighty warrior, let me know what the command is for that. Ah, uh, yeah, my tzatziki breath. Take it! I hate that stupid drum. Don't do that, game. Like, I can't imagine this even came out in North America. I, I don't even know where this was made. It doesn't subscribe. I want to say it was made in, in the West and not Japan, but I can't honestly tell. I'll have to look this up later. Like, I only look up the basic most information on a game, like it's year or whatever. And some of them, I'm like, no, I need to look this up a bit more than others. I just saw a, an arcade game called Mighty Warriors. I saw two screenshots. I'm like, okay, that's uh, use that for the video, right? Just take it. Take the tzatziki breath. Yeah. Punch you in the nards. You know, that's, again, that's how all ancient wars were won. When someone got hit there, they're like, I'm done. That you conquer my continent. I don't care anymore. I'm going home. Well, that's how wars are won. Ow! This stupid whooshing effect. Oh my god. Stop, dude. Oh my god, I lost it. Lost my shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. You'd think he would be able to survive his own breath. Like, it's not that bad. He'd be like, yeah, I like it. I like my own brand. My own musk I, from my mouth. Mouth musk. I love that shit. No. Yeah. Got him. Okay. I love my dude jumps for joy. He's so happy. He's doing so well in Mighty Warriors tournament. Zeus is not enough for you. What does that mean? Zeus is not enough. What the? Oh, give me a second to prepare. Who's shooting this shit at me? These ancient Roombas? Like, I know they're catapults, but why are they so small? And who's maneuvering them? Why can't I hit it anymore? <laughs> I got one. This might be the most awkward bonus stage I've, I've seen in a long time. Okay, that was the end, apparently. Did I do good? All right, let's switch it up to this big dude. What? Nabonido. Okay, Nabonido. Oh, oh, that's the noise that this sprite would make. A lot of heat haze in the back. It's very distracting. It's a hot one today. Oh, Jesus. Okay, so what's nice is that even though it's a tag game, you share the same life bar, so I'm not I'm not at a huge disadvantage. Uh, that's something to be thankful for, I guess. Oh, okay, yeah, just switch back to the other guy. You knew. Oh, I did it somehow. How did I do it? God damn it! Smashing buttons. Stupid drum. Stop your drum solo. It's for the countdown timer. No, it's not. It was. Why did it happen? Oh, big suplex. Love that for me. Get in there. No. Oh, a taste of my own medicine. No. No. Uh. uh. Oh, I was doing good with that strategy. Oh my god, that's like two hits. Fucking SPD out of nowhere. Yeah, 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 that's the way. That's how we cause big damage. All right, this guy, I'm feeling this dude. I don't gotta do anything fancy. Just gotta use that sword. And like, I don't even lose it if I get a good streak going. Now you look like you're... Ca okay, we said that before. All right, keep going with uh, with with Adamame or whatever this dude... Nabonido. Uh-oh. So many mirror matches in this video. I swear. Too many. Ah. Uh, oh. This, this, this. This is the key. This is the key. Like I said, I just gotta get one good one of these. Yeah, that's that'll do. That'll do, Nabonido. I'm still mashing buttons trying to figure out how to tag. It's a weird system because I don't really know what it adds. If you share the same life bar, 
Unless there's team up moves, what's really the point of doing it? I mean, I guess you can experience most of the fighters that way, but still. Oh, good shit. Yes, I was the superior Nanaimo. I was better than that Nanaimo. That guy's, wait, his name is Sargon. So yeah, the clone characters do have their own names. Sargon, that must be a common hero name. You are only a flabby fat, guys! <laughs> oh... Okay. Yeah, this is this is the African stage. It, it was gonna happen sooner or later. Yeah, let's switch it up to Hang Sing. I, I, I or let's switch it up. I, I I accidentally selected him when I didn't mean to. But I imagine he still has the same principle. Ooh, he's got a flaming fist. That's cool. That's something. Just, come on, just take it, take it. As long as this stupid thumping drums doesn't happen again, I'm fine with that. You are a flabby fat guys. The best. I hope that happens again. Uh, I guess I guess it was because I took uh, Nanaimo before. Jeez, that this this guy seems pretty brutal. That was like an actual decent special attack. The and then the cycle crusher. Why not? How do I even do that? Charging back doesn't seem to do it. Oh, all right, round three. Yeah, I'm. I wanted to push this to the maximum level of excitement for for this uh, this long play. Zero credits used of Mighty Warriors. <laughs> I just realized how fast the time counts down. Like, it's less than a second. Each second. They just want these contests over quickly, I guess. Die! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, give me fl flabby fat guys. I want flabby fat guys on the board. Have you still enough teeth to eat today? Boo! Okay, yeah, let's go back to, to Nanaimo. What?! Cypher? Why is it Ghost Rider? Why is it ancient Greek Ghost Rider? I didn't know he had that attack. Oh, maybe you can only do it when you're, you don't have a sword. He, I'm gonna put it, this motherfucker in the thumbnail now for sure. <laughs> ah. Oh my God, that's just Sagat's, that's Sagat's body type and his wind pose. Th that's even his, his, uh, his uh, ready pose. Like just his idle pose. Jesus. Oh my God. Why are both time-based warrior games like rip-offs of other stuff? You should eat much more rice to be made. <laughs> Why does the devil cypher ghost rider guy he loves rice? Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll Nanaimo bar it. Sh stop it with that. Yeah, he can transform, but he just transforms to a guy that doesn't have a weapon on him. Like, he's got his weird uh, rubber fist thing that was on the little string. That 90s toy. Is on that snot string, you like slap it on shit. That's his weapon. That's what he felt was uh, appropriate. It's like he had a wish to get any 90s weapon, like from far and far in the future. But he, who's given that? So either given that or Nickelodeon gacked or rhythm sticks. Okay, let's let's focus up. We can actually do this. He just sends out a little ghosty of himself. All right, get fucked, sir. Get those big meaty hits in. Yeah. Is that it? No. Okay, good, 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 good. There better not be another form. Swear to God. Why isn't Jesus a playable character in here? I think he could, I could think he could throw hands. From now, my family will mean the world to me. Why weren't they important to you before, asshole? Hello? Stop responding. Okay. Oh. Huh? So that was Mighty Warriors. I have no idea what the hell I just played, really. Uh, it's bizarre. It's not terrible. In fact, none of the games so far today have been have been really bad, but uh so yeah, that was Mighty Warriors. That's an awful logo. Um yeah, we have we have one more game we're gonna be playing today, and uh that will be coming up next. I don't think I'll be returning to this one anytime soon. Cause of the stupid drums. Recycle it, don't trash it. Please do not trash the last game we'll be playing today. August 1999, man has lost 90% of his population under the crash on Earth, the unknown force called the Force. The surroundings have changed. In order to protect themselves, man has... Jesus fucking Christ. Why does that have to be so fast? All right, so this is Superior Soldiers. Uh, it's another arcade game. I, I, it's completely passed me by. What? Wow. D d wow. Okay. I could barely handle that. Uh, reptilian. Ooh. Daddy likes. Arabian Moon's quite nice. But reptilians got them scales, though. 
it's it's the Godzilla fan in me. What what can I what can I tell you? What the meltdown? Okay. Oh oh, a lot of fire spearing. He is a Godzilla. Oh my god, he did the Hedora movie thing. What the fuck? That has to be a reference to it. Okay, well we're not playing. Meltdown is not playing. He's got good reach on his normals. Jesus Christ, that's like. That hit- that must hit low. Alright, well I got- I got fire breath. That seems to be the, the thing I have. I got it, alright. Uh, graphically this looks quite nice, very busy. I think this was made by Irem. Irem's pretty solid in most, uh, respects. Okay, no, yeah, that's not good. I mean, he has an actual projectile. Like, he's got me locked down like he's fucking Deathstroke or some shit. Oh my god. Oh shit, you see that blood? Damn, okay. Yeah, yeah, munchy, munchy, mmm. All right, we can do it, we can do it. What? Whoa, it's just triple suplex? <sighs> K, fuck, does it double KO? My God. All right, this is the first character in the game. I should, I should, why do I do that? I just think it's a projectile in the back of my head, but then, I, then I'm reminded it's not, but he has one. <laughs> What's with that car screeching sound effect? <sighs> I, I also feel like I'm I'm the dinosaur character that got shit uh, from King of the Monsters. I have that sort of feel to me. Jesus, fuck meltdown, man. I don't know. Uh... <laughs> it's Lem's Day for Reptilian Flamethrower to the right. Yeah, I I did that. Let's let's try Arabian Moon. Let's not just keep uh, running at a brick wall with the same character if that didn't work out. Let's smug look on Meltdown's face. Fuck him. What does she got? Uh... Nothing? What? Do I not? Oh, I have that. That is slow. Nothing is coming out on any anything. Okay. Mmm, smash. Mmm, smash. Smash or pass. Is that all I got? Unless she's a hybrid character and has like charge moves? I don't know. Okay, I, sh I, sh I should just focus on winning here. Like, he has everything. He has a projectile. He has like a triple suplex so I can't get too close. And has a DP. Oh! Yeah! Two can play on that game. Okay, okay. But barely by the, the skin of my balls there. This is, I don't, why is Meltdown already such a problem? It's highly defensive now all of a sudden. That comes out like really fast. Like it's a cool looking move, don't get me wrong, but like, fuck. Ah, oh, how do you, yeah, 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 yeah. Two can play that game. And I'm the second of that too. Shh. All right, it's fine. It's fine. Second round, but like we're meltdown, and which feels like a image uh, character, image comics. Uh, would be surprised, and we're in front of a nuclear factory. Uh, I'm assuming he's as powerful as he'll ever be in front of this stage. I still have not figured out a single special move uh, aside from that weird flip kick, and it's way too slow to be that useful. Oh, there we go. Okay, wow, that is a sprite. <laughs> So yeah, that's that's lightning legs. So a second one has been found, confirmed, has been found. It's eleven o'clock. Do you know where your special moves are? I told you last night. No. Maybe we can do this. No, no, we can't. Stay away. Stay. Ah. Mm. Oh. Oh, all right, Meltdown. Meltdown 2, Matthew 0. I feel like there should be quotes there, but there is a moon slash. Press the kick button. Yeah, I was doing that. That was the, the flipping heel move. Star Saber? This bad Captain Commando? He's just Captain Commando! Christ! Capcom should sue. Retroactively sue Irene. I don't even think they exist. Oh my god, fuck that move. I'm not hitting nobody with that. That is such a slow projectile. At least it's full screen. And he just- did you see him? Slide under it? Meltdown has all the tools- oh my god. Star Saber's the worst, like he's got a standard moveset, but- Oh, his attacks are so slow. Am, am I not beating Meltdown tonight? <laughs> what, what a way to possibly end things. Ugh. I mean, it's because I've been playing all these fighting games all day. And, uh, what little skill I accumulate is- is rapidly leaking out of all of my holes. I know that's not a pleasant visual, but like... <laughs> you- you- th this has to be unpleasant for you guys as well. Alright, alright, alright. Ah! Uh, what the fuck? How can he- how can he keep doing that? 
He's like a radioactive wrestler. He's Adam Bomb. Oh my dude, so pathetic. Force cannon. Yeah, that's the lame projectile I had. Bus Busido, not Bushido. So another attempt at meltdown. Okay. What do I have? I have to have something. I have a sword at least. Okay, yeah, he take that. that. All right, shockwave. That's fine. Anything else? Okay, he just jumps over it. The 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 AI knows what it's doing. It's it's getting in my head too. Like I have to respect meltdown and all this shit. Oh my god, that's every character I take has like a special move that's the slowest. It's oh my god. <laughs> you serious? Alright, calm down, calm down. Alright, I have to go on, on the offensive. Like, I guess the best I did was as Arabian Moon. Oh my god. And even then I was outclassed by him, by Meltdown a lot. His name his name is that, but I'm the one that's melting down here. My brain at least. Shit! You like he's 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 just radioactive Zangief. Zangiev! Oh, I'm so pathetic. Oh, down up? Down up kick, so I guess that was something. Let's just take this fucking thing, whatever the hell it is, it's terrible. What is this guy? He's like furry and gross. And is this a pants or is it fur? I don't care, what do I got? At least I have decent reach. Oh my god, I'm also slow as shit as well. Oh, my dash is something. <sighs> you know what I get off this just because of the, the character design and such? Uh, it's real galaxy fight, but galaxy fight is incredible. Uh, but I'm obviously not playing that today because I've heard and played galaxy fight over the years. Um, but that's what I'm getting from this. I'm not sure if any of these characters are aliens. Maybe satin sect in sat insect is or satin sect. I that's an awkward name. Come on, have not found a special yet. Jesus, look at my jump. Look at my jump. I'm not. I'm not doing this. It ain't happening. This music is now like burned into my retina brain, into my into my ear mouth. <laughs> I'd be I'd be humming this tonight. Anyway, nothing, nothing. Not charge moves, unless he's got like a 360 like up close. Okay, maybe that's a grab. I can't tell. I honestly can't tell. All of his movements are so awkward. Meltdown, he's, you, you notice that he's just toying with me. He's like, yeah, practice your moves, I'll wait. Like, I feel like this this is a super powerful AI from like 2023, but back in like 95 or whenever this game was made. And just retroactively just listening to what I'm saying and reacting to it. Like, it's storing the data. Time over. That's even lamer than my previous losses. Attack, move the joystick quickly forward. He doesn't even have special moves. They don't even give it. All right, let's take Caddy Docs. The fuck? It's just some chick with a, with a scowl. What is that? She fucking grinding that shit. That money maker's paying dividends. Oh, what? I, I found a move. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> That looks amazing. What else do I have? I, j I just have spin on my ass and just ho hopefully everything will work out. That's that special move. The only other character after this is Meltdown himself. Maybe I'll have a shot there. Oh, why is this so hard? He's the first guy. My only hope here is like you... Well, no, that one that just wouldn't even help me. But I was gonna like maybe if you, I start over, like reset the game, and then I'll I'll be started off on uh, like a random ladder. It'll be another character at least. But I mean, we're seeing all the characters, not the stages, obviously. But because I I'm not. <laughs> oh, I, I guess I guess we know why no one's heard of superior soldiers because no one's gotten farther than this. Flying turn kick. Make a B dash quickly with the joystick four and press the hard kick button. That's just the standard move. Let's take meltdown, I guess. It's my only hope. All right, that's the shot. Cool. Every everything I'm doing is just the shot. What's that move? Maybe that was just a normal or like a command normal. I don't even know how I did that. What? What was that? Oh, nice. Oh, that sucks. Oh my God, he's he's mad. He's mad, huh? Big ass mad. Stop. Just let me win. Please. I'm your twin brother. <laughs> Meltdown 2. Fuck. Oh, I thought I was dead. I thought I thought I killed. I thought I killed. Yeah. Getting desperate. Three hours later. Dude, dude, 
please just walk into my fist now. I'm so tired. Just <laughs> ah! <laughs> uh, I'm just doing moves at random now. <laughs> I can't beat the first guy. He is a superior soldier. Fuck this game. I'm done. I hope you enjoyed this six fighting games I've never personally heard of before. Um, all of them were really solid, even Superior Soldiers, despite it being so ass numbingly hard. But let me know what you thought of the video if you'd like me to do something like this again in the future. There are there's still a good few fighting fighting games I've seen its name, but I've never heard of again. So do let me know and I'll give you more fighting game style entertainment in the flop house.